As we inch closer to the youth football season, First Down Playbook will begin to go in and add more and more plays. Uh, we already have thousands of them in there that you can edit. But we're going to really focus this week on the trap. And we've got the trap in out of several formations, but as we've begun to put in shoot formations and spread formations, because more and more youth football uh, teams are running that, we want to make sure that you have a trap play as well out of those formations. Now, a couple key points about the trap. One is that when you run the trap in youth football, odds are you're going to be outnumbered because if you're playing against a good defensive coach in youth football, they're going to have them all up here on the line. They should because odds are your quarterback won't be able to throw as well as a high school quarterback, college quarterback, or obviously an NFL quarterback. So your scheme is going to have to account for an unblocked gap. But let's just start with the basics of the trap. And once again, we'll draw this up against a 6-2 a 5-3, a 4-4, four, four, and a bear. So we'll start with the center. You always want to make sure that you block back and that you make sure there's no leakage over the top. You want to have your trap happen as much in the A-gap as possible. Playing a 6-2, you've got a good chance of doing that because you've got two, two techniques right here with these tackles. All right, so pretty easy here. If you, get up, you end up with a shade, you're going to have to veer off after the initial steps. But let's look at this right here. Your center block's back. Now, you want to take your play side guard right here, and you want that guard to inside release, if at all possible, and check the seal. If they have to seal anything here over top the center, they need to do that. If not, they need to work the second level and block the backside backer. So that's what you're going to do there. Now, over here with the tackle and the tight end, you just want to cut off, get wider splits. When you run the trap, you want to make sure that you open up as big a gap inside as you can. Over here, backside guard. This is the fun part. You want to open, and they want to stay as close to the line of scrimmage as possible. Your aiming point for the person that you're trapping, and you tell this guard they'll trap the first defender on the line of scrimmage from the A gap out. And so what they're going to do is they're going to try to trap this tackle right here and hit them on the inside number, inside shoulder pad, and work the head inside. Okay, so now backside is cut off. That's a key point. You might want to widen your split over here as well, just to make sure that you give your chance, uh, give yourself a chance for success. Backside over here, you want to cut off, and your wide outs are the same on the outside. Now, here's what we were talking about initially. You're going to have a situation right here where you're going to have an unblocked defender, but you want to run your trap off of something to the outside. So I know a lot of you are running uh, quarterback sweeps and that type of thing. So this quarterback right here can do one of two things. They can take the snap, back out, open up the A-gap for the H right here, all right, execute the handoff, and then head down the line of scrimmage to create flow with this play side backer right here who will not be blocked. The other, Or if you want to, you can even reverse out with your quarterback. It's got to be a tight, you know, you almost have to open up at 6 o'clock right here, execute that handoff, and then do the same thing. And the last thing before we get out of here today is that if you wanted to run this, I mean, essentially, I know a lot of you are running your quarterback. Put your quarterback in the gun right here. Take your tailback. Obviously, I've got them labeled wrong by doing it this way. But have your tailback do that to influence this backer. And then let your quarterback take the shotgun snap and run a quarterback trap. 